Hi everybody, and welcome to our Friday night stream. Uh, we had a pretty nice looking bundle to this weekend, and I couldn't resist. Uh, so we're going to be cracking open some Skylinks crystals, some Star Saber crystals, some Smokescreen crystals, and some Premium crystals. And you know what? We might even crack open a couple of Gnaw crystals that we've got from the event so far. And um, we're doing pretty good. I think we've got two so far. Uh, we'd probably have, uh, I think, four by now if we if they hadn't changed the uh, prestiges from 6,000 to 7,000. So um, actually, I think we got three crystals. Uh, so uh, we'll be doing that. And I think I've got a three-star maybe. And you know what? If we get that four-star dupe, we'll be cracking open that five-star crystal tonight. So uh, cr fingers crossed uh, that I get a four-star dupe uh, or four-star Gnaw Skylinks or Star Saber. And uh, we'll also be taking a look at Volcanicus a little bit later. Um, and because uh, I got a couple of new toys in. So, uh, so without further ado, oh yeah, and we've got some Gnaw replays coming up too. But let's go ahead and get through uh, some of these uh, crystals. So we got some people in the stream, Sergeant Prowl Prime, SS Destron, Cameron Moore, Shark Z, King Gamer, Jeremy Plays, hey buddy, how you doing? Alexander Rose, aka Razorquake from our Alliance, Dirty Spot, thanks for the share, buddy. Uh, Jameis Vega, I think I got that, uh, sorry if I didn't. Red Alert, welcome to you, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Uh, Texatron, good to see ya, good to see ya. Tyler YT, Superior, Superion, oh, he, look at that, he's got a three-star knock, congrats to you, man. Uh, hopefully I have your luck or better because I still just have the, uh, two-star knock. So, you know what, let's go ahead and open these three knock crystals and see how we do. No luck this time, just a shark attack. Although I do like that battle boost, that is a, uh, uh, very good boost. 2,000 spark, that's uh, pretty nice. And one more Gnaw Crystal. Uh, okay, so just another Shark Attack. So no luck on those right now, but we'll keep battling through the events, getting more and more. And uh, we pull a duplicate two-star Prowl, getting some Optimus Maximus Spark and some more three-star shards. And it's thinking about it for a second, and we get a duplicate Drift two-star. Now, one of those crystals that I have over there is a three-star crystal, which I got from the first prestige of the three-star uh, crystal shards in the event. So we got a two-star smoke screen here so far. And, ooh, look at that. That's a duplicate Springer of two stars. Oh, we got some more comments. William Norman, it's good to see you, man. He's got a wild morning. Oh, no, Space Ape stole your four-star Skylinks with a bug. I hadn't heard about that bug. Uh, but you got a f Snarl and Fireflight and a new four-star RC and Hound. Not bad. Yeah, that's a... Uh, uh, RC's actually pretty good once you get her leveled up. I've got her at about 46 now, and she's uh, very, very strong. And uh, that... Um, ability of hers is very underrated it's uh, not useful all the time but it's very good so man you got a lot of dupe four-star dupes too man I hope I have that kind of luck Connell Novak says he got both Skylinks and Blitzwing oh he pulled the Decepticon bundle as well too look at that I got a couple of silver power cores from these two-star dupes so that's a little bit of a bonus there's another Springer two stars only though Premium crystals aren't really working out too well for me. We get a silver bolt, two stars. Dirty Spot says Hound is a nice gunner above 55. And you know, I haven't got him even that far yet, and he's already a pretty nice gunner. Uh, we got a three star Springer duplicate. Okay, so that's cool. Gives me some four star shards. I'll take it. We got a duplicate Perceptor now, two stars. And there's a duplicate RC. I'm just going to go ahead and run right through these premium crystals and see how we do here. Two star dust up. Two, 
two star hotspot. Oh, he's saying they were broken. They would light up and then crash the game. Oh, wow. That's that stinks. Yeah, I hope they got that fixed. That would be that would be a real bummer. Two star dust up again. Power glide showing up. Two stars. Christian Cruz, good to see you, man. Got another Perceptor, just a two star though. Silver Bolt gives us a two star. Getting some pretty nice Superion Spark though from all these Aerial Bots coming in. RC doesn't give us any though, she just gives us regular old Spark. And some Attack Power Cores, which are fodder for upgrades. And oh, look at that! It is a snarl came in at the last second, but he's just the two star, not the four star that I need. Okay, so let's go ahead and run through these smoke screen crystals. I've already got all the smoke screens, so hopefully I'll pull a four star dupe out of these. But nope, just a two star this time. There's another RC. And another RC. Are these RC crystals or are these smokescreen crystals? Come on, man. <laughs> and there's Firefly showing up. He's a three-star version. Gives me a little extra Superion spark. And those all-important four-star shards. Duplicate two-star skydive. Some more Superion spark. Wow, look at that. Uh, Connell Novak says he got a Nemesis Prime out of the Barricade Bundle that was going on this past week. Congrats, man. I, I didn't get the Drift Bundle. <laughs> As we speak of the devil, there's a duplicate three-star Drift. And thinking about it, gives us a slog. Just a two-star, though, so we're still looking for that four-star dupe. And let's go through some Star Saber Crystals, shall we? Wasn't lucky enough to get the four star in that last bundle that I did a couple weeks ago. There's a Jazz two star as we saw. I got that four star Jazz uh, from a four star crystal not too long ago and I've got him over 40 now. There's a duplicate two star Snarl. There's a Star Saber, but he's not the four star that I want. He's just a two star. Five more of these to go. There's an Ultra Magnus. He's a surprising one to find. He's just two stars, though. He's about it. Those, those are probably the two biggest bots, size-wise, uh, in the game. There's an Alpha Bravo. He's a good one. Uh, two stars, though. I'm just looking for four-star dupes. There's a Firefly. He is, thinking about it, he's just a two-star dupe. Two more star Sabres. Man, we get a sea spray. You're not a star saber. Not even close to a star saber. All right, one more star saber crystal, and it is a duplicate strafe. Two stars. Still not even sniffing a four star. Man. Would it be crazy if I got a duplicate four star prime? It would be crazy. You know why? Because he'd probably have a four star matrix of leadership, but I'd love to have that. There's the first Skylinks crystal. That's not Skylinks, that's Jumpstream. There is Silver Bolt. It's still not Skylinks. Two more of these to go. Oh, it's lighting up. Three stars. Three star Skylinks. There we go. Happy about that. It's not the four star, but I'm happy with the three star. That, that makes it worthwhile. So very cool seeing the three star sky leaks come through. Very nice. I'm happy with that. And one more to go. And uh, it's Cliff Jumper. Three star Cliff Jumper though. Gives us some four star shards. And we do have a couple of more crystals to get. Uh, one is just the free crystal. We'll go ahead and grab that. And, oh, look at that. We've got two three-star crystals. And, unfortunately, even if they're dupes, that's not going to give me enough for a four-star crystal. I will go ahead and grab them on my Autobot side, which are going to be guaranteed dupes, so I can get those shards. 
go ahead and open this free crystal. Ooh, force field. Yeah. I don't use those. Uh, there's a duplicate smokescreen three star with some four star shards, and the next duplicate three star is Slug. It gives me some of that volcanic spark. Although it doesn't do me any good right now because he is maxed until I can get that four star snarl. Hmm. Okay, so here we are again. No, I am not going to get that right now. Uh, how close am I to that four star crystal? How many? I am 370, four, five, three stars duplicates away from a four star crystal. Hmm. Uh, do, 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 do. William Neronis asks, do you know what the spring bundle they teased in the live stream is? I don't know. I caught that too. I did see the Prime and the Megatron there though. So, uh, you know, it's interesting. A lot of people are uh, complaining that we haven't seen a Prime or a Megatron bundle since like early last year. Um, but uh, they did have some Prime and Megatron bundles going around in the Black Friday. That's actually where I got my four-star Prime from. So, But it has been since November since we've seen any bundles of Megatron or Prime. So it would be interesting. I, I'm interested to see with that. And, of course, since, since we're getting this uh, mixed bundle here during the weekend, we'll be getting that spring bundle in the, uh, starting, I think, Tuesday is usually when they throw that out there. And, uh, hmm... Okay, so uh, somebody's saying, look at the Alliance chat. Okay, so I did ask some guys to uh, uh, the Alliance to share some Gnaw replays. And, uh, yeah, okay, so we'll get to that in a little bit. Uh, Chris Dodd is egging me on, saying, bring on another bundle. Uh... Tyler YT saying I should get the 450 premium crystal, hoping for the dupes. Man, I buy a lot of them, and uh, all I ever get is two-star dupes. I buy them one at a time, thinking that it's just going to be, you know, uh, maybe I'll get lucky. Because there was one time on my Decepticon account I had just enough coins for a premium crystal. I bought that one premium crystal, and bam, four-star blast off. So it can happen. You don't have to open a whole bunch of them. Um, but you know what? Uh, I was already thinking I might buy a second bundle if I didn't quite get what I wanted. I'm happy with that three-star Skylinks. But I'm going to pause for a second as I go. I'm going to go get one more of these bundles. Because uh, I'm really hoping to get that, though. Get, maybe I'll get a four-star crystal. Maybe I'll get one of these that I want out of here. and uh, Or if I could just get that four-star dupe and uh, get that... Uh, five star crystal uh, somebody was asking uh, it's, it's a little ways back which five star do I want um, it's interesting and uh, once I get this taken care of we'll go back and look at who is available in the five star crystals I know who it is but uh, it'd be a little more interesting I think for the video um, in the uh to show that off okay let's try this again it says the purchase failed I don't, i'm on my ipad i don't usually make the purchases from there let's try this one more time i think this happened last time i tried to try buy a bundle on a stream all right it's all set here we go and we're coming back there they are are we going to use the crystals now? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, click into there. Um, but we'll go over to the Get More and take a look at that five-star crystal so I can answer that question. Um, five-star crystal, here's who is available. We have Optimus Prime, Wheeljack, Skyburst, Drift, and Windblade. Okay, so here's my thoughts on this i think skyburst would be great but i just got her at four star uh so i'd probably put her at the bottom of the list only because i already got her at four star wheeljack drift and windblade i do not have at four star and i did get the optimus prime at four star obviously optimus prime five star would be amazing to get uh 
but uh, Wheeljack, Drifter, Windblade, I think, would be uh, the ones that I would uh, prefer. And uh, Dirty Spot is saying they're all great five stars. You can't go wrong. I agree with you. And that's why I'm thinking if I get the five, as soon as I get the five star shards, I'm going in on this crystal uh, instead of waiting. It's, it's a good idea. Uh, William said uh, the, one of the last streams that says that there should be another five star group come around so it might be worth waiting to see who might be in there because who knows maybe star saber could be in there but you know what rc might be in there too so you know you get you kind of kind of like the last one silver bolt was in there nobody really liked silver bolt uh so there was a there were some good choices with grimlock and there were some bad choices with silver bolt in here i don't think you can go wrong with any of these uh like i said i still haven't really figured out how to use drift yet uh but i know lunar fury is another uh, youtuber uh does uh transformers earth wars videos he pulled a barricade which is the drift counterpart on the decepticons uh as his five star and he's having a great time and i'm seeing a lot of good stuff coming from him so um so i wouldn't mind having a having a drift i would definitely learn how to use him if i got him as a five star that's no doubt um but if I had to rank them, I'd probably say Wheeljack because I don't have a four-star healer. And then maybe Windblade or Drift, uh, Optimus Prime, and Skyburst in that order. Speaking of healers, there's a first aid. He's just a two-star, though. Yeah, Sharksy's uh, saying last time it was Nah, Sunstreaker, Silver Bolt, uh, Grimlock. Oh, there's a three-star with some four-star shards that I need. Uh, uh, Grimlock and, oh, I can't remember either. It's been a while. I, di I didn't have a chance of getting them. There's a, speaking of Silver Bolt, Jeremy plays is hoping for a five-star prime. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Hmm. Cameron Moore says he likes Silver Bolt. You know what? I like Silver Bolt too, uh, but between the of the choices that they had as a five star, he was definitely the uh, the uh, lo the worst choice out of those. There's a drift. Oh, a hot rod was the other one in that uh, the last five star. Just getting a bunch of two star dupes here. We're seeing a lot of drift showing up. I'm, I'm, I'm. I don't know why, but I've got this feeling when I pull that five star, it's going to be drift. Like I said, I still would love to see it be Wheeljack or pro or probably Windblade before drift. I'd be happy with drift. I'd be happy with any of them because it's going to be a five star, and they're all good bots. There's a Cheetor. Two stars though. Still, we saw his buddy Optimus Primal come up a moment ago. Gnaw would be so fun. Yeah, Gnaw was a Gnaw was one of those, wasn't he? Sun Streaker. Still just two stars. Hound. Two stars. Three more of these premium crystals. Two star star saber. Sterling Wong's Alpha Prime from Prime Union. Hey, man, I, I've seen you through uh, around a, a bunch of the chats. Uh, good to see you. Thanks for coming and joining the stream. Yeah, if anybody know, doesn't know, uh, Prime Union is one of the top alliances, and uh, I've seen this guy's bots in base before. He is a monster. If he, if he gives us any uh, tips or, at all in here, Pay attention to what he says. That guy knows what he's doing. All right, so we're going into the smokescreen crystals now. We've got a two-star drift. Still haven't pulled a four-star out of any of these. Haven't pulled many three-stars to even to get us to that four-star crystal yet as we get teased with another two-star snarl. There's a smokescreen out of a smokescreen crystal, finally. Still just a two-star. Man. Luck has not been smiling on me uh, lately. Although I did get that three-star Skylink, so I can't I can't complain too much. 
would be not man they know i'm one four star away and they're just holding it back they're holding it back man there's a smoke screen still just a two star uh five star snarl did i say five star snarl uh he, he would be great though man that snarl is a powerful bot i got my three star to level 40 i haven't got him back into rotation yet but he he is the second strongest dinobot behind grimlock there's another Cheetor. Oh, Sterling Wong pulled a five-star prime. I bet you're loving him, aren't you? Okay, so eight more chances at this four-star Star Saber, which I haven't had any luck. Pulled a bunch of those crystals a couple weeks ago and didn't get any of him, and now we're getting an RC. Oh, it's lighting up. Four stars. Is this him? Yes! 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 Four star Star Saber! Oh man! He is a unicorn if there ever was a unicorn. Wow, I'm so glad. Oh, finally. Oh, I cannot wait to get this guy leveled up. I've seen what some people can do with this guy, and he is a beast. I love my three star, but oh. Okay, that is. Oh worth the money worth the money okay i still need that four star dupe though because <laughs> i still need it. still need that four star dupe okay all right there's another star saber is it my four star dupe no it's a two star of course it's not gonna be the four star oh that would be crazy oh man okay we're getting we're getting through uh two star strafe there's another three-star crystal, so that might help me get to a four-star crystal. There's Ultra Magnus, uh, two-star. I don't have him at four-star either, uh, but uh, oh, four-star Star Saber, guys. Wow. Uh, two-star hotspot. Um, last Star Saber crystal is another Star Saber. Yeah, he's just a two-star. Okay, so we got four Skylinks crystals to go. I got the three star in the last bundle, as you guys saw. If you or if you didn't, we were still joining us. So we're still looking for the four star Skylinks, or honestly any four star dupe, so I can get that five star crystal, or at least some three stars, so I can get some four star shards. But we're just getting all these two star dupes. Oh, here we go, Sunstreaker. There's a three star crystal. Ooh, with a gold power core, a gold rejuvenate. That's a good one. I've got a rejuvenate on a hot rod, and he never dies. Last crystal is a duplicate Alpha Bravo. Three star shards. Okay, let's go over here and get some more. Pretty sure this is three star. Oh, uh, and would you look at that? I'm more than one dupe away from a four star crystal. <laughs> All right, so we'll open that up. Which dupe do we get? We get Hotspot. All right, and how far away are we? We are two three-star dupes away because we are 92 <laughs> shards away and you only get 90. Oh, hmm. Oh, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I'm not getting that one. I, I did add it up. Uh, I, 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 was, I was curious while I'm sitting here contemplating whether I go in for another bundle. Because if I go in for another bundle, I'm almost certain to get a four-star crystal. Uh, but I'm not made of money. So I do have to think about this. So while we're sitting here thinking about this, as you see my uh, four-star Star Saber, let's, let's follow him around. Let's tap on him. Walking past probably my three-star Skylinks. Come on, tap on him. You know, when I'm trying to tap on bases, I hit these bots all the time when I don't mean to. And then when I'm trying to tap on him, I can't. <laughs> then I hit the wall. No, I'm not trying to hit the wall. There he is. All right, so we'll follow Star Saber around. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> derp, derp, derp. Absolutely. Okay, so as we follow him around, I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh. What was I saying, guys? <laughs> oh. 
We got distracted. Um. Hey, I know those aren't the right words, Josie Love, but watch it. We try to keep it clean here. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, because it looks close, I'm going to uh, put that out there. Okay. Uh, hey, Zalon. Good to see you, man. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely happy. I got the four-star Sire Saber walking around, and I got a three-star uh, Skylinks there, too. Um... I don't even remember what I was talking about, but I'm still still thinking about uh, still thinking about uh, wanting, to, <laughs> wanting to go go back in there. Uh, if only I could have just tapped on Star Saber, uh, spend more cash, dude. I, I'm not made of money. Oh, but uh, hey, we're gonna see him transform. There he goes, and his head's popping up. But you know that's accurate to the toy, so. Hmm. Oh, you guys are egging me on. One more bundle. One more bundle. One more bundle. <laughs> R.I.P. Paycheck. No doubt, man. No doubt. <clears throat> Save your coins for Star Saber. Oh, I gotta get some more coins, man. I'm down. I'm down to just a few. Uh. Okay. You know what that thumbnail means. Go for the $10 bundle. Dude, I don't get $10 bundles anymore. $40 is the cheapest they give me. Oh, I know what I was talking about. The uh, crystals. Uh, the crystal percentages. Um, I was curious about... Cause, Cause, you see some bundles. Uh, I'm, I'm looking at the one that pops up sometimes. That's a hundred dollars. Gives you eighty premium crystals, versus only uh, fifty of the bot specific crystals. All right. Uh, so um, here we go. We've got the crystals. We're gonna go and hit the use crystal now. Uh, but we're gonna go look at it. Uh, so we're looking at the percentages here. This is what I was going to be talking about. Okay. So if you look at the percentages. For the Autobot premium, for the regular premium crystals, you get a 1% chance at a 4 star. So that's like 1 chance out of 100 for every uh, crystal. Now it doesn't accumulate, but the, uh, but the character crystals gives you a 1.8% chance. Uh, so basically, out of 80 crystals, which is the 100 bundle, you got 80 chances out of 8,000 uh, to get a 4 star bot. But with 50... Um, character crystals, you've got actually 90 chances out of only 5,000 chances. So you do have a better chance of getting a four star crystal or a four star bot out of the character specific bundles than you would out of just a standard premium crystal bundle. The math is a little complicated and it's probably not exactly correct, but character crystals are the way to go if you're going to be. Uh, uh, spending the money. Oh, <laughs> Zalon is asking, is, is is it peer pressure? Nah, dude. I was I was going to be getting these anyway because I'm so close. I am tired of waiting. Uh, but uh, yeah, yeah, a little bit of peer pressure. See, peer pressure would be if I didn't want to do something and people egged me on to get it. I wanted to do this. You guys just helped encourage me. So there's a hot rod that we're pulling, and you know, I remember when we he first came out, he was Rodimus, but now we got Rodimus Prime, so he's just hot rod now, as he was always originally. There's a duplicate Firefly. We are getting ever so close to that four-star crystal, and you know what's going to happen? We're going to pull a four-star dupe out of this bundle and not even need to get that four-star crystal. But that'll be fine because that four-star crystal would be a chance at a new bot. Or it would be five star shards towards my next one in about three years. <laughs> nah, it didn't. It's not that long. Oh, there's the four star crystal. We're gonna go ahead and open the rest of these though, and there is Snarl. Two stars though. There's RC. All right. Yeah, Sterling Wong. That's that's all I get is the the thirty nine and the ninety nine. That's all I get. 
The, the only time I get anything less of that is those ones that just kind of pop up and they want you to buy like fuel cells. I, I still get some uh, 19 uh, of those, but uh, in the bundles, all I get is the uh, 39 and 99. <clears throat> all right, so we're, we're getting through there. We're halfway through those premium crystals. There's a cup. There's a Prowl, two stars. Ooh, there's a Huffer, three stars. With a Volatile Mixture, that's a good one for the Gunners. I like, I like putting that on the Gunners. <clears throat> Does a four star dupe give you 50 five star shards? No, it gives you uh, 150. If, no, 100, or is it, no, it's 180, I think. Hopefully we'll find out, because I'm a hundred away, so I know I'm I'm definitely uh, uh, if I, if now see that four star crystal could be a new four star bot. We thought thought we were getting it the last time, but we ended up pulling jazz, and so so there's still no guarantees yet, guys. We we definitely getting the four star crystal, but there's still no guarantees that it's a five star. Thanks, Sharksy. 185 star shards. Okay, let's go ahead and get get that last premium crystal. You guys are saying, let's go get the uh, four star crystal. Okay, let's go ahead and go get that four star crystal. You guys are tired of waiting, and I'm tired of waiting too. All right, four star crystal coming at you. I'm gonna make you wait a little longer. <laughs> and we get to look at the four star crystal now. <laughs> uh. Okay, now let's go ahead and open that four-star crystal. Uh, dupe or new bot? Oh, there it is. Duplicate. Silver bolt. 185 star shards. And that's a good one to get because that's 2,500 superior spark. I'm not enamored with the death pulse power core, but that's okay. We should be seeing. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Look at that. Five star crystal. Five star crystal, guys. So what do you think? Open the five star crystal now or get through the rest of them and see maybe we get the uh maybe we get the Skylinks. Jeremy plays uh shout <laughs> here's your shout out. Thanks for the luck. Oh, here we go, guys. All right, we already talked. If you, if you weren't in the stream earlier, somebody asked, who do I want? Let's go ahead and hit that little question mark ever so carefully. We're getting one of these guys right now. All right, Jake, glad you made it. You got here just in time, dude, because we got the five-star crystal. We're about to crack it open. So out of these five, Skyburst is probably at the bottom of my list only because I got the four-star already. Uh, Prime is uh he's prime i'd be happy with him uh but wheeljack drift and windblade i don't have a four star of any of them so those are the ones that i'm favoring and uh honestly now that we've got uh, the hq 16 the bases are going to get harder i could really use a strong healer on my a team wheeljack is probably the one i'm hoping for but i'm going to be happy with any of these here we go Maybe wait a few seconds. I'm waiting. Yeah, I've seen a lot of people get Skyburst. I've seen a lot of people get Drift. I haven't seen a lot of Wheeljacks. I don't have a four-star healer. I, and that's why Wheeljack is the one I'm hoping for. All right, guys. Here we go. Three, two, one. It's lighting up. Who is it? Oh, <laughs> Skyburst, the, the one that I didn't really need. Like I said, I'm happy because it is still a five-star bot. Five-star bot, and she is a good one. I Because I do, the five-star, I mean, the four-star that I just got is killing it. Uh, j just got her past 40. She is killing it. Uh, okay, so I'm going to have to find another place for her because uh, five-star Skyburst is going to be... Uh, 
uh, being on my team. I, I'm like I said, even though she was the bottom of my list, I am in no way disappointed. No way am I disappointed. And and uh, with Victorian possibly coming out, didn't really need her because I do have the four star that would help out. But it'd be still it's going to be really nice when I go um, into seeing that Victorian in the Combiner Lab, seeing that five star sitting there. That's still going to be pretty cool. All right, so let's go ahead and get through these smoke screen crystals now. All right, uh, Sterling Wong saying best gunner not to worry. I, I agree. Uh, you know, ooh, guided missiles. I'm not sure if I got that. It's a bronze. So you, you know what disappoints me though, Sterling? About even though she is a gunner, she's classed as a special, so you can't actually use those gunner specific power cores on her. You can't put a volatile mixture or a flak jacket. I'd I'd love to put put one of those on there. Hey, there's a <laughs> there's a duplicate four star now. Uh, speaking of flak jackets. Because uh, see, see, I would love to have something like that, a, uh, a uh, put a flak jacket or a volatile mixture on her. But uh, right now on my four star, I've got a. Would you look at that back to back four star dupes, back to back. Couldn't have done that earlier and saved me like forty bucks. <laughs> hey Jake, don't worry about it. There's no need to feel bad. I do not feel bad at all. Skyburst is an excellent bot, and uh, yeah. Excellent, excellent bot. So, so I'm already uh, two, two, uh, two uh, four-star dupes towards my next one. Twenty-four to go, I think. Isn't, it, isn't that something like that? Twenty-six dupes, twenty-six four-star dupes to get a. Uh... Sterling says he's got Skyburst on his A team three three two. I'm not sure if I understand the three two part. There's another Star Saber. What is that? Three gunners and two healers. I've seen a lot of those going around. Put an attack core on her. Yeah, that's what I've got on my four star as an attack core. Three gunners, two healers. Okay, yeah. Uh, Jake Moore says his Transformers hoist toy just arrived. Uh, no, the only reason you got him is because I love him. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Just make sure you love him. You know, so that that that's that's the important thing about any toys that you get. Make sure that you love them, uh, or at least think that you'll love them. Because I've gotten some that I think are going to be good, um, but uh, are not. <laughs> Would you look at that? After all that, not getting a four-star star saber. Here's a duplicate four-star star saber. This is unbelievable. See, they they knew I already got the duplicates, and now they're just throwing them at me. <laughs> this is crazy. Another flak jacket that I can't put on. Sky first. <laughs> oh, where are the new toys? Yes, I did promise you doing that. Uh, well, let's go ahead and get through these uh, bundles because that, that was the uh, that's actually the title of the video so uh, I'm, I'm tapping as fast as I can and we still have four star skylinks that we're looking for all right four four more crit maybe five uh, we get a slog we get a jazz Two more Skylinks Crystals. Dust up. And... Oh, it paused for a second. I thought we were going to get him, but nope, we got a two-star cup. All right, so this is probably a three-star crystal, so I'm going to head over to my Decepticons because uh, I've got a, actually a chance for a new bot on from one of these. Probably still a dupe, though, because I've got a lot of three-star cons. Nope, it's a new three-star con. Who is it? Ah, Octopunch. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take it. I only run two Decepticon teams, so uh, so he probably won't be seeing a whole lot of play. Um, all right, but it does add to the team overall team power. Uh, so you can see my combined power is 106,000. That that includes the Decepticons. So there is Skyburst sitting there at the top because I have got it uh, sorted by star rating. Whew, that is nice. And, uh, ooh, look at that Star Saber down there. I can't believe he came in, too. 
that is amazing. The Star Saber, he is not going to be at the bottom for very long. He is going to be right up here, uh, hand in hand with the Skyburst or Optimus Prime or Grimlock or something. He's going to be right up there very fast, very fast. And uh, uh, Skylinks too, he's down here somewhere. There he is. He's down there. <laughs> lower than cosmos <laughs> not for very long okay the hardest decision is going to be who do i level who do i level oh uh, monty i don't know i can't pardon that french man this is non-toxic gamers we try to keep it clean in here that's uh cro that's uh, that's kind of close to crossing the line okay so all right, uh, Light Dragon 88. Uh, I think you're new to the stream. I haven't seen you. Oh, Puffamus Prime just joined in. Good to see you. Uh, so, uh, Light Dragon is asking who will best fit with the Alchemist Prime core. Uh, so, if you had, didn't see this Transformers Earth Wars stream on Thursday, yesterday, I guess. Uh, they talked about the new Prime Core coming, and that's uh, Alchemist Prime. Uh, we talked about it on Wednesday, although we didn't know what the ability was. They told us yesterday that his ability is basically a life-stealing. So basically every bit of damage that you do, you earn a percentage of that back in health. And it's very similar to Drift's uh, special ability where he rushes over, causes some damage, and takes some of that health on for himself. And I believe they just added that ability to Cheetor and uh, Black Arachnia, of course, for the cons. So, who would fit best with that? You know who would fit best with that? Anybody who does a massive amount of damage. Uh, I would think... Uh, Star Saber would be a fantastic one because if you rush him across a whole base, he does damage to everything along the way and it is a wide path. And he does a lot of damage too. So I, I, th I think if you put an Alchemist Prime Core on Star, Star Saber, he would probably be unkillable. Uh, Skylinks does a lot of damage as well too. I think he would be a good one. Um... And uh, Lifesteal Skyburst, yeah, that, that might be a good one. Um, all right, so so yeah, definitely. I think uh, I think I, I would probably put it on Star Saber. Star Saber would be uh, amazing with uh, Alchemist Prime. Okay, so I, I wanted to show you guys. Uh, you, you've seen Volcanicus on in Transformers Earth Wars on on my stream before. Um, a bunch of times. So, in fact, let's go ahead and go into Combiner Lab and take a look at him. So, there he is with that big sword. That is actually the uh, same sword as the Fall of Cybertron um, Grimlock. So, so yeah, there he is. He's got uh, Swoop or Strafe on the one arm, Slag, Slug on the other, Grimlock's a torso. He's got Sludge and Snarl down as the legs. So, but, you know, Transformers are also about the toys, right? Let's go ahead and go over here and check out Volcanicus in the flesh. There he is. I just got these two guys in uh, just yesterday, just in time for the stream. And I tell you what, uh, he is uh, quite impressive. I mean, check out that noggin on him. I got a little sticker uh, peeling off on Grimlock's head. But yeah, you got Slug. I, I do kind of wish the head turned around on uh, Slug, slug uh, like it does in the game. Uh, Swoop looks pretty cool. And uh, I kind of like how the snarl tail is splayed out like that. Although I can see it'll cause a interference problem there too, so it might not be too bad to actually kind of keep it, uh, you know, not quite so wide. That would probably work well if he was an arm, um, you know. Uh, and I have seen some fan modes where they uh, do have it together, and uh, it's it's probably not too hard because it does kind does kind of form back like that so you can kind of put it together something like that and uh, so that might not be uh, too bad of a look uh, to, to keep the clearance in between the two legs uh, and Jake Moore is asking are they power of the primes yes they are these are the power of the primes Dinobots formed now as Volcanicus 
And uh, so now, if you're a, if you're a collector, and you've probably seen that there is a perfect effect. They 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 uh, um, made a lot of upgrade kits for the combiners during Combiner Wars, and true to form. I'm sure they were very happy to see combiners coming back for Power of the Primes because they've got some upgrade kits for this guy who's going to make him amazing. You know that big sword that we've got in the game? They're making one for the, for the toy. And they're also making some upgrades so that he's a little bit more stable, not quite so uh, spindly through here. You're not going to have to fill in the gaps with these extra uh, hands. And... Uh, so and then of course they will come with uh, some more uh, articulated hands and uh, the uh, the feet also I think are probably going to be uh, much larger. Although these feet are actually pretty good, I'm very impressed with the uh, power of the Prime's feet. They're far better than the uh, Combiner Wars uh, hand foot gun things that they gave us uh, as far as feet go. Uh, the hands wise, they're roughly the same, uh, but I definitely like the feet better on the power of the primes uh figures uh so okay so let's head back into the game as we look at the back of volcanicus uh, <laughs> now uh before we get going here um yeah connell novak says he's on the three third party voice yeah he's always back there he's, he's kind of the mascot of my channel i gotta have him in there somewhere <laughs> Okay, so I did ask, ask our guys to give some uh, um, replays of Gnaw. So here's one from Red Alert. <clears throat> the only thing that could have made this stream better would have been like a four-star Gnaw or even a three-star Gnaw. Or like a four-star... Uh, Skylinks, but man, coming out of this with four star Star Saber and my first four star bot uh, Skyburst, that's a, that's just amazing. Hey, check this out. He's got a three star gnaw, man. I am so jealous. Let's get these power cores out of the way. Oh, he dropped the uh, the frost bomb. I forget forgot what that is. That, Nice, and he destroyed it and s slowed everything. Doing a lot of damage, clearing that out. Man, that was a good use of that little uh, battle boost. I haven't used that in a long time. Let's go zoom in on little Gnaw here. Oh, he's, he's fighting right along with Cheetor. He's got a Laser Prime and Warpath, too, with bot we just got uh, a couple weeks ago. Uh, Jet Fire and Ultra Magnus, and they are just tearing through this base. Uh oh, but they got Scourge up in the air. Oh, there's Slug over there, too. Oh, he dropped his little Sharkies over there. I love those little Sharkies. Oh, uh, Scourge took them out, though. There we go. Oh, there's some more of the little Sharkies there. I love those little Sharks that uh, Nod drops. Awesome. Very cool. Thanks a lot, Red Alert. And if you guys haven't, uh, go go check out Red Alert's channel. He does uh, uh, some very good toy reviews over there. Nano Frost. That's it. Thank you, Texatron. Hey, Tyler YT. Don't worry about it. I, I appreciate the, uh, the the belated congrats, man. All right. Let's see. Uh, Razor Quake's got... Uh, Got a replay here. I should probably just turn off that record option because I, I don't do that on the iPad. If I record anything, I'm recording it on the uh, phone. So. There we go. Okay, so Razor Quake is saying it doesn't have knob, but it does have something similar. There we go. Look at all that. We got Bumblebee and uh, Prime and Ultra Magnus and Hot Rod and RC and Pyramagna. Yeah, I love that Ultra Magnus ability where he just bombs the heck out of that. Cool. 
Megatron, thank you, thank you. It says it's one of the best streams I've ever done. Well, I, I, you, got, you got to thank Lady Luck for that, uh, for giving me some great, uh, <laughs> uh, some great uh, pulls there. Hot Rod and Bumblebee over there taking care of business. You know that e EMP from Bumblebee is actually pretty useful sometimes, especially when it does damage. It's, it's great to drop that if you got a large group, like say you say you uh, send Jazz in there and um, and he, he doesn't quite destroy everything if you got bumblebee nearby and you can drop an EMP a lot of times it will go ahead and uh, take that down um, so yeah the EMP is actually really good yeah same thing like with uh, silver bolt oh is he you guys you got somebody hiding back behind there uh, he's there they're behind the he's got he's got the little shark attacks he did drop the uh, shark attack boost I totally didn't even see that if you look close back there, you can kind of see the little tail behind the headquarters. <laughs> there they are. Nice one, Razor Clake. I like that. <laughs> I was just sitting there. What's going on with the headquarters? Nobody's attacking it. Uh, that was that was fantastic. You know, back before we had Cup, that's how I used to deal with the uh, headquarters that were all back there by themselves. I would just drop one bot, and then I would drop those little gnaw, uh, that the shark attack. Uh, boost and the, and a lot of times they would just take it down. Uh, the only times that they wouldn't is if the bot would uh, pull open up a outpost and then the other bot would go back there. Sometimes it didn't always work, uh, but it worked a lot. All right, so Optimus Gamer has a non hot rod solo. Cool. Let's go check that out. Hey Alexander Rose, it was awesome, man. I, I liked that uh, Razor Quake. That was that was a great replay. Thank you, man. That, I really do appreciate that. Oh, he, he's just got a little baby gnaw. Look at that. Uh oh, Sterling Wong saying, "Don't do that." What are we? What are we not supposed to do? Well, the uh, shark attack uh, boost. I don't do that anymore. Oh, look at that! We had we had uh, we got some sharks taking this headquarters down. It's a low level base, but hey, it's a low level now. We we had to get, we had to, we couldn't take it all in too high of a base and uh, let him die. So good, thank you, thank you very much for that replay. All right, you know what, guys. I'm uh, I'm starting to starting to feel it. I'm starting to feel the uh, feel a little tired. I after working all day, I'm a little tired, and I'm I'm it, got an itchy trigger finger to go start uh, getting those uh, bots leveled up. I really do appreciate everybody showing up and sharing in with me, and uh, four star star saber, three star skylinks, five star sky burst. This could not have been a better crystal. Uh, cracking uh, video unless I could have done that all with one bundle uh, but uh, really I do appreciate everybody and thank you to our non-toxic gamers uh, who uh, were kind enough to share their replays and uh, so as usual we do uh, the Transformers news every Wednesday evening right about 8 p.m. Eastern and where we talk about what's coming up in the weekend event and so uh, I think that's going to do it for us. Uh, once I get this video posted, I'll be throwing up a link for you to subscribe if you haven't already. And go ahead and hit that bell for the notifications so you know when I go live or post a new video. Uh, there will also be a playlist up there so you can see any of my past videos. And, of course, a link to our Non-Toxic Gamers band channel where you can go and join in on the discussion. I'm Engineer Hoist. Keep rolling, my friends. Thanks for watching.